Okay, so we're in the Wichita Mountains in Oklahoma. We're very close to our campground. Um, we should be there within about four or five minutes. We are on the way. So we're at Doris Campground. There's quite a few walks to go on. Um, the tracks are not very well signposted. You just sort of forge out and try to remember where you're going and where you've been and how to get back. Anyway, I'll give you a little panoramic view of where we are at the moment. Here's my darling wife having a rest. And we're sort of halfway up the side of a escarpment here. And all in these trees here is where Doris Campground is. And I think my wife's given up and she's heading back. So I'll get a switch off and follow her. Okay, so Doris Campground has a variety of different uh, campsites. You've got uh, tent sites. Um, they have uh, no power, no water. Uh, they have uh, group sites, so you've got uh, half a dozen sites where tents can be put up. Uh, they have the asphalt sites which have power and no water, and that's really your lot. You uh, have no sites here with water and uh, sewer. So if you do come here, make sure you bring uh, water with you or uh, containers. There are uh, faucets scattered around the the campsite where you can fill up containers of water um, it's a nice spot absolutely no mobile coverage whatsoever um, but you only have to drive 10 minutes and you're in a spot where you can get good coverage um, so yeah would we come back nope definitely not um, basically because we've seen everything. <laughs> uh, overnight stop would be fine, no problem at all. We'd come back for that, but um, we wouldn't make a special trip to come back here. Um, but a nice, nice spot in Oklahoma. So some of the things that uh, you can see while you're here in the park, we've had uh, longhorn um, cows or bulls or whatever they are, longhorns. Um, there's bison just down the road. Uh, obviously all the normal things like squirrels and eagles and lizards and all those manner of things. Chameleon. Oh, there was a chameleon. We did see a chameleon, yes. So, yeah. Um, so if you want to go somewhere where you can see some um, bison in the wild, or it is bison, um, this is a good spot to come and see that because they are everywhere. Now, one thing to bear in mind, we came in on Thursday, today's Friday. Uh, yesterday there wasn't a lot of people in here. Today it is packed out. There are so many people here for the weekend. So if you're planning on coming for the weekend, make sure you got your bookings. So here we are at our campsite. It's got power only. Uh, we've got 80 gallons of water on board with the bus, so we're not too worried about water um, for a three night stay. So there we go. Thanks for watching guys. See you next time.